All right, this is my homemade ram pump. Homemade ram pump. Now, if you don't know what a ram pump is, a ram pump is a pump. It'll pump water without electricity or without a gas motor. Needs no external power source whatsoever. So it's ideal for a stuff hits the fan situation, grid down situation, or a homestead. It's ideal for it. I'm gonna do two videos. I'm gonna do this video here explaining how I made it. And then I'm gonna do another video of it actually working and running. Now in the one that I do with it working and actually pumping water, I'll explain to you why and how it is pumping. But I need to do that while it is running. That way it's easier to explain. You can see everything. I actually have another video. It's way down on the, at the scroll through. It's, uh, it's about a year old. And it, uh, it shows this very one running. It's working, works super good. It's pumping really high. And uh, you can watch that. It's not, it's not a good quality video. It's not, uh, it's not HD. It's not good quality. The picture isn't real good, but you can still see good enough. So check that out. Now I don't have a, a lake or a stream or a river or whatever to uh, actually run this thing. So what I used was a water tank for a water source. We just pretend like that's a lake. And I did it just for a demo. Anyway, all right, let's get started on this thing. Hey, grid down, stuff hits the fan situation, you need these. Doesn't matter if you can use them right now, at your house right now, where you live right now, doesn't matter. You never know when you're going to need these. So uh, you never know where you're going to end up. Bad situation, you never know where you're going to end up. So make you a couple of these. It's about 100 bucks right here. All right, so this is your water source coming off of your lake or your pond, river, whatever. This is, this is all galvanized stuff here. And then the shutoffs and the check valves are brass. This is all one inch. The whole thing's one inch. Schedule 40. This is your water source. Schedule 40. And we got a union. Now that union is there so you can work on that ramp pump without messing with the water line. That's your union. A little short piece. This is all one inch. A little short piece. And we got our uh, brass shut off. We got another short piece. We got a T, short piece, brass swing check valve, short piece, brass swing check valve, short piece. We got a T, short piece. Then we got some bushings here that come off this one inch and it's bringing it up to a two inch with a couple of bushings going into a two inch coupling with a two inch pipe going into another bushing under there, three inch coupling, three inch pipe with a three inch pressure cap. Use the rounded cap, it's the best kind. And I got about a four footer here total length on this tower. And this thing is filled with the uh, swimming pool noodles and swim noodles and things you float on. Uh, they, they're yellow and green and red and orange. Anyway, I'll explain to you while this is working, why you put those noodles in there is to give them a sponge effect. But they're filled up probably at 60, 70% of the way up here. Stop somewhere in here. But we'll, we'll show you that in another video. Two videos, only because I don't want them to go too long. They get real boring, so we'll do two videos. Okay, we got a T. Then we got some bushings that reduce this down to a half inch. 
elbow, short piece. You don't have to have the gauge. Gauge is nice to have and you'll see why in the next video. T, short piece. Then we got our shut off, which is brass. I used a shower arm because it's what I had. And this is where the water comes out. Of course, it goes way up to wherever you want to pop it. But that's it. No need for an external power source. No need for a power source, period. This thing works off of gravity with a little bit of pressure from that gravity. And that is how it works. I'm going to do another video showing exactly how this thing works, why it works, while it's working. I've got another video that does the same thing. The picture quality isn't good. But this is a ram pump. But check that other video out if you're interested. I mean, doesn't matter. You still get the idea. Hey, make a couple of these up. I, I may go ahead and make up another one and let you video that. Just so I'll have two. But make you, make you one or two of these things up. Have them around. Never know when you're going to eat them. You never know. You never know what's going to happen. They, they, it would come in handy. Oh, well. All righty. We'll see you. That tower's about, I don't know, four footer, I guess. I don't think it has to be that tall. We'll see you.